Hey, welcome to Trending on Shaw. My name is Phoenix, and no, this is not Kate. It, it in could, fact, it could be an April Fool's joke. I am Kate morphed into that would be into funny, somebody else. <laughs> Jeanette Roche, who is actually part of our Lethbridge affiliate, is you that true? That, I, I think it's true. Even today. All right. Join? All right. So joining us this morning, we have a lovely panel of guests. We've got Karen Whiteman, who's the executive connector. Yes, the executive connector of SVP, which stands for Social Venture Partners. That's right. And we've also got Andrew Fung joining us this morning. Uh, Andrew would not have won that without some great coaching. That's we right. do have a coach here. Dave, now, Dave was not Andrew's coach, unfortunately, but uh, Dave Hughes joining us from Imperial Oil, and you are a fast pitch coach. And we're going to talk right. a little bit about that. Let's we'll jump right into Our it. playgrounds are too safe. Yes, they are. They, they are. are. Really? Yes. yes. Okay. On a Skype video call this morning. Get That's this, right. another artist that you've invited from Lethbridge of all awesome. places. Who is this guy? All right, this is Grant Bertamini. Hi, Grant, good morning. Now, Hi. Grant, you're an artist of sort, but you're a teacher. Um, you're yep. a teacher down in yep. Lethbridge. You teach the little guys, the elementary school. I think it's grade two, three, grade three, four. That's right, two, three, yeah. Okay, now the interesting thing about Grant, and I absolutely love this, you started up a little charity called Art for kids art for a cause. Okay, That's right. Kids Grant, art for a tell cause me all about this. Now the April art just went up online. Um, it's the cause the causes for Canadian Red Cross right now. That's right. Uh, yeah, we, we had some students at Park Meadows. They decided they wanted to, to design a project to fight Ebola. To fight Ebola. So what are the what are the pictures looking like? I know there's like messages of hope and life and love. Mm. And it yeah. shows kids that they can make a difference. That's right. kind of the idea. Good for you, That's Grant, because awesome, you're Grant. making a difference as well too, getting these kids involved. And this involved. was actually uh, put together by Tom Tom, the GPS unit, mm -hmm. and they collected data from cities all around the world. And it turns out Calgary is the seventh worst in Canada, Canada. which isn't really that bad. Yeah. We're behind, I believe, what. Toronto, Montreal, Vancouver was the worst. And this morning what I found was it's true. It's really, it wasn't too bad. And of course, coming from Lethbridge where my commute is what, seven minutes yeah. every day. So now it's 25 minutes. <laughs>